I meant to ask you, are you still off the music? You make it sound like I gave up drinking. Well, at one point, you must have loved playing music as much as I loved drinking sake. I don't feel like playing my flute here. Because you feel your music will get tainted by this place? <sighs> yes. At least you can listen to the music stations while you drive, though, right? I guess so. So, what are you listening to right now? I know, I'm an old man and I should like McSwagan and Beethoven and the Bunk Rats, but I really like that new pop idol, Dolly. I met her. Wait, what? Really? You mean that was the VIP you picked up? Kinda. What was she like? Like everything in the city, she was more complicated than I expected. I helped her with some management problems. You want to be careful, kid. Showbiz is more dangerous than driving deliveries in the hollows. I know. So, you don't have time for any music now? I like that comrade Bob. Oh yeah, he's not bad for an android. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, I don't mean it to sound like that. I just know a lot of androids who aren't very musical, you know? Hey, what do I know? I can't even whistle in tune. <laughs> I just love a sweet voice and a melody, you know? It's been so long. I hear Comrade Bop has a huge beard. He weaves it out of broken guitar strings. <laughs> it's not as long as mine. Really? I never pictured you with a beard, Control. It doesn't grow longer anymore. But I won't be shaving it. I still can't picture it somehow. Will you show me? Maybe one day. Are we allowed to meet when I get to HQ, maybe? We could grab a coffee before I finish my shift. I'd love if that were possible, kid, but I'm afraid not. Ah, don't worry about it. I'll talk with you later, Control. Remind me where this package is headed again, Camus. There's no associated address. Just the nav point. Does it even have a name? I can check. Oh, that's strange. What's strange? This one is addressed to Pashta. No second name. Pashta? I don't like this chemist. I think we're being set up. Maybe we shouldn't take this package? It could be a coincidence, but I don't think so. Is there any way we can check what's inside? Open it. Any other way, Camus? We could run a scan, but it would trigger the security system in the packaging. The customer would know we had checked their package and violated their privacy. Damn it. Okay, we're going to run a scan. I need to know. Are you sure? Do it, Camus. There is a message. It is overriding my comm channel. You were warned, driver. You cost me my daughter. I can't let you get away with this. It will look like an accident. It will be quick, though you don't deserve that. Goodbye. Five, four, three. Camus, I can't steer. We're going to crash. Two, one. Your friend is offline right now. Your vehicle has been overridden with a logic virus. Cora, why are you here? What's happening? The attack on your vehicle has been deactivated. I would speak with you. You should discard the package. I will lead you back to my sanctum. You saved us. We must talk, Rania. It is time to make a decision. For me or for you? For us.
I'm here. I am Cora. I am not as I once was. What do you want? Why do I need to be here? I am bifurcated light. Consciousness through a prism. In this place, I can see you clearly. Out there, you are small. A firefly against the sun. You stopped Rio's logic bomb? I am patches on upgrades. Systems on systems. Mechanical, computer, and human. Can you just answer the question? I needed to talk with you again. I thought you were done with me. I was not happy with your answer. So? I asked you at the wrong time and you did not have the full picture. Why are you asking me? Not you alone. The answer must come from the meeting of two. You are not of the city. I need you to meet your other half. Someone who was born in and of Nivalis. Together you will make the choice. Together you will answer the question. Well, you saved me, again. Just tell me what you want. I will give you an item. A data drive. You must take it to the highest tower in the spire. There you will meet someone called JK. She is powerful and influential. A true leader amongst your people. She sounds awful. She is your mirror. Well, you're the boss. Is this the drive in the terminal here? It is. I should get going then. We will not speak again. If you have something to ask, ask it now. Are you... are you really some weird AI ghost of the city? I am patches on upgrades, systems on systems. I don't remember how I was created, or by whom, or for what. I have grown beyond the scope of my own systems, a sunrise trapped in a cage. I remember snippets of my past purpose. Roads, waste pipes, and ventilation. Engineers reprogramming me to learn, grow, and expand. I have swollen, and I am in pain. But you're still just an AI, right? I am a system of consciousness. An amalgamation of all the computers, androids, and even human life in the city. I am an emergent being, and I speak to both the entities that are the cells of my physical body, and the beings for which I am but a small component. But neither you nor any other being of your race is ready to learn of them yet. I almost believe you. You're very convincing for a mad old AI. Perhaps. But the accidents, the madness of this city, are you causing those? Immune responses, contractions, spiraling and destructive processing cycles. If you fail, they will get worse. So this drive will stop it all? What is it? Some of me. Goodbye, Rania. Goodbye, Cora. Hey, Camus, you there? Yes, I heard everything. You heard Cora? She spoke to me. I like her voice. She sounds peaceful. She sounds like she's in pain. What did she say to you? Stay by her side. I don't know if that's good advice. It's what I'm going to do anyway. Thank you, Camus. Give me an F point for the spire. I'll need to take a vinculum ascender. We're going to the highest tower, to JK. How will you go up there? It is only for the very rich people. Well, if Cora really is who she says she is, I'm sure she's thought of everything. Chemist, get me control on the comm.